Hi everybody and welcome to the last of our activities in this um, messy Christmas in a bag series. This is activity seven and um, we're going to make the stable for our nativity scene. So hopefully you've kept the bag that your activities came in and as you can see what I've done here is I folded the top bit into the side so that it makes a roof shape okay so what we're going to do next is we're going to draw some lines ready to cut out a space here so if you lay your bag flat and then use a pencil and a ruler I have marked about five centimeters up from the bottom and five centimeters up from each across from each side and then drawn some lines. So I'll do it with the felt tip so that you can see. Hopefully. I'll use a felt tip that works and then we'll be better off. Okay. So I am going to just draw this in. Also done is I've marked off a center strip in the middle so that's what I've done so far and then I've marked off a center strip in the middle so that it gives our bag a little bit more um, rigidity so that it won't fall apart so there we go like that okay so then what we're going to do is we're going to cut out those shapes that we've made. So if you're not very good with scissors, ask an adult to help you. Um, you need to make, first of all, a little cut and it get itself going. And this is going to be noisy, so I'm just going to be quiet while I do it. <laughs> You're going to leave the centre strip in place. Don't cut that bit out. going through one layer of the bag when you're cutting. <laughs> Open this out and put your hand inside. Open it out. And it should form quite a nice nativity stable shape. There we go. And we can check that out by putting. Come on, Mary, you can go in there. Mary in there. Hard to do without. There we go. And Joseph. And all 
all of your other nativity characters so we can put in our baby Jesus as well in the manger. I have knocked Mary over, that was level. Right, there we go. And all the animals that you've made. And then you can have your shepherd's visit and your king's visit and put your star on the top. So let me know how you get on with that. And on Sunday, we'll be doing the story and you're going to need your um, stable and your figures and we'll go for it together. So I hope you had fun making that. So God gave us the gift of Jesus at Christmas time, didn't he? So I'd like you now to take time to relax and think about what this gift of Jesus means to you. Bye for now. See you soon.